This month, the AIA awarded the first Coatsen excavation grants to Thomas Strasser of the Department of Art and Art History at Providence College and Justin Leidwanger of the Department of Art at the University of Toronto. Each grant winner will receive $25,000 to support excavations and research. Strasser was awarded the Coatsen Grant for Mid-Career Project Directors for his work at the Mesolithic site of Damnoni on Crete. Leidwanger received the award for first-time project directors for the Marzamemi Maritime Heritage Project in Sicily. The grants are made possible through the generous support of former AIA board member Lloyd E. Coatsen. Tickets are still available for the AIA Annual Spring Fundraising Gala in New York City. This year's Greek-themed event honoring Malcolm H. Wiener will take place on April 24th at the Tribeca Rooftop. Don't miss the opportunity to read about exciting underwater searches for the world's greatest ships and their stories of adventure, conquest, exploration, and more. Purchase Archaeology Magazine's Shipwrecks Special Collector's Edition at 17% off the cover price at archaeology.org. AIA Local Society events in March included the 4th Annual Milwaukee Archaeology Fair, co-sponsored by the Milwaukee Public Museum and the AIA Milwaukee Society. Over 2,000 people attended this year's successful two-day event, including school groups, homeschoolers, and families. More than two dozen presentations featured intriguing activities such as ancient games, making medieval picture books, and discovering the natural resources that were used by Native Americans in Wisconsin. As in previous fairs, Greek hoplites, Romans, Celts, and Renaissance knights and ladies were on hand to interact with the attendees. South Carolina Society President Alvaro Ibarra and AIA member Ralph Muldrow demonstrated the Buon Fresco technique for archaeology and historic preservation students and the general public at the College of Charleston. Over 50 people showed up to see the transfer of an image onto fresh plaster, the mulling of authentic pigments, and the painting of Michelangelo's Delphic Sibyl. Several attendees also took a turn with the brush, a communal effort that rendered a remarkable fresco. In addition to these and many other great locally planned events, the AIA provided over 40 national lectures, including eight lectures from AIA past president and Joukowsky lecturer, Brian Rose. The AIA received over 150 applications from the Waldbaum Field School Scholarships. Since the scholarship was launched in 2007, the AIA has sent 44 promising young scholars to field schools around the world for their first excavation experiences. Get involved with the third annual Archaeology Day that will take place on October 19th. Visit archaeologyday.org for more information. The AIA promoted Archaeology Day to new audiences at the George Wright Society meeting in Denver. The George Wright Society is dedicated to the protection, preservation, and management of cultural and natural parks and reserves through research and education. Just as a reminder, Society Outreach Grant applications for events taking place in fall 2013 are due on April 15th.